One of the biggest morale boosters for GIs and their families overseas are American television programs. In the past, the current affairs programming wasn't very current. But as Phil Bremen reports this morning, that's now changed. Communications satellites long have been of military value. Now, overseas, individual GIs and their families are benefiting too. The following program is a live presentation of the AFRTS satellite network. Five, this six, is AFM four, Television Europe. Three, two, one, ready remote, hit it. From NBC what a Hummer, huh? This is Great. today. Starting yesterday, the U.S. military's television service in Europe began carrying American news and sports programs by satellite every day. The new programming, in addition to the entertainment shows they were already getting, reaches an estimated 400,000 service members and their family members in West Germany and is being extended to most U.S. military posts worldwide. The commander of the American Forces Network in Europe. It's, it will actually bring home on a timely basis uh, to the soldier station here. We'll be signing on the air at 6 o'clock in the morning. With American the network news used to be days or even weeks old when it got here. Now it will be delayed a few hours at most because of the difference in time zones. That's why the Today Show comes on at 4 in the afternoon on European clocks. Even so, the new service is a welcome link with home. You can almost reach out and touch it right there. Uh, it's a big morale booster. In faraway places, the U.S. military does a lot to make GIs and their families feel at home. Now, like the groceries here in the commissary, the news they get will be fresh. Phil Bremen, NBC News, Frankfurt. And for our friends here at home and overseas, it's eight minutes past seven o'clock here in New York. Let's go back now to Brian. Okay, John, thank you. Nice touch. I, they're going to get a Nielsen box next week, I understand. As noted, this is uh, Mark.